Okay guys, so we just reached at Sanam Chai Stadium, not stadium, uh, station, and first time here with the new decoration. Not really much decoration, just uh, they spent some more money, right, on it, a little bit more money. So nothing too much, but we're heading to the farm market now, and check first, we gotta find the uh, areas where they have all the flowers. Thank you for interrupting me. Okay, so see you guys there. reached here all we gotta do is find the flower market just somewhere around here I'm not sure oh the river it smells it smells pretty bad I think it's around here I remember it's like a roundabout something around here I think we'll cross So it must be one of these areas uh, as I look in the map and it's not far about like a three minute walk from the station where I was just right here I got me man I'm tired already <laughs> my bag's a bit heavy but better than before so hey, gotta get strong man yeah gotta get strong remember the Amazon cafe was here and then uh oh there's a police station there and then Oh, must be here. Sorry, man. <laughs> Cross again. Okay, guys. So we're in the area Talat Dog Mai, I think. I'll find the name, but this is where all they saw the flowers. As you can see, not any bad for these yellow flowers. Really beautiful. Being really great to give it to your loved ones, parents, family, or couple, boyfriend, girlfriend. It's a really good price. A hundred baht for all this. A lot of good stuff here, and then also. We got some more stuff they're selling on the other side some like local thai food stalls and stuff so you got all this i think it's like a lot of flowers here we can go here man so look here lots of flowers so really good price you got loads too and you got this like a store like this all around 50 to 120 baht if you see hey. we got more flower shops here um, so we go to a market where there's have much more flowers in our area and we got lots of more flowers here for 100 baht they look really nice, so you can buy them a lot in bulk stuff. It's pretty crowded here, man. All this stuff here. 300 baht for roses. Roses tend to be a bit more expensive than usual. So, I think here is a really great place. Oh, so we found a floral cafe. Here's a coffee shop. And then more flowers. Here. So I think this place really great place. I recommend if you want to buy flowers. Um, buy a lot for a good price too. So we're gonna enter somewhere else to see what they have. Quite busy at this time of the day. Which should we walk? Which should we walk? Alright, so I was this side, now we walk to this side here. We're gonna enter the, the flower market around this area here. And we'll see what they have around here. I think it looks really interesting and stuff. So, let's see. Let's see what they have around here. Quite a lot. So I think there are a lot of prepping for selling of the stuff here. So let's see what they have. This is the Talat Dog Mai. So which means flower market in Thai. We got lots of stuff here. So, 
this now. This is the whole market underneath this roof. They have like literally every flower that you can find here. So this side a bit more or less crowded. So these are quite common for flowers that you crave for the spiritual, the Buddha. So these are actually quite common too, so they tend to buy them a lot for like temples or when you want to pray. So here a bit quiet. More yellow flowers. And here I think believe is the fruit section which uh but you don't really tend to have flowers, but just here is just fruits. What do you call these yellow flowers? The yellow one. The yellow one. I know the what dog my malai. Dog my malai. So here is from uh, the backside point of view. You can see we have dog my malai. And uh, these are quite common too. I think like at home you actually I'm not 100 percent sure. Quite busy this time of day, I'm not surprised. But I think the majority of flowers here are yellow. No. the fire just went out the lights went out all this stuff here 20 baht 40 baht 15 baht get in bulk and stuff so the fire just went i mean the lights just went out so fight up how do you call it some more stuff you say left or right? Uh, take a right. Fine. Take a right. 10 baht, 50 baht. I think these are pretty good deals. So this is what it looks like from here. And out back over there was all the, I think it's food. I'm a bit scared that if people give me the look. How do you say orchid again? The dog koi, right? Oh, dog my koi. Banana, that's banana. Yeah, I'm trying to record you while at the same time not getting myself uh, smashed. See, right, a lot of people doing it done right. What, what do you think they're doing? What do you think? I think just preparation, right? Prepping or renovating? Or like cutting, renovating. A bit of both. I think also delivery is the main one. Deliver like one place to the next place. We got like lost stuff here. Look like cherries, right? 
Mm. Looks like cranberries. Oh yeah, I think cranberries. So that was very nice of the lady. She invited me a little bit. Let me try to ask nicely because I just want to get a few photos for the blog. All right, guys. So we are here at Yacht Piman River Walk. Apparently, Harry said there was a Starbucks right over there. So I don't expect that there would be a Starbucks train, which is unexpected. And Starbucks in this area is not what I thought would it be, but why not? I guess. So we're gonna catch a boat now to Chao Phraya River uh, to Icon Siam and have a long walk down that river walk opposite this Icon. Then we're gonna check out the Starbucks over there, see how that's like over there. Entrance to. So I believe the the boats are on here. I think so. But you get a good view of what I ruin around here. So it's, just gonna walk. it's a bit quiet. There's no one here. Should be like a nice sunset. I think. So Starbucks is there. Yeah. Starbucks by the Chop Fry River. And we were actually there a few last week ago. Right on Thursday. Chop Fry Skywalk. And here's one of the temples. Right there. And then a lot of ruins are actually over there. So we're gonna head that way. So how's the journey been so far, Harry? Pretty good. Pretty good. Interesting, right? Okay. You, did you expect there'll be a Starbucks there? Like kind of. Kind of. There's Starbucks over there everywhere. Unexpected places. You never know, right? Mm. Why not, right? Why not? Unfortunately, there are lots of clouds, big cloudy, but I think the sunsets here will look great. Unfortunately, they're not in service. Uh, I think this is where I usually hop on the boat right here but there's no one here and it seems that's closed the door here is locked so no one at the ticket booth so i'm running out of options but there is a way head back to the icon sayam that's where we want to go a few shops here nothing too much okay. So we ordered some tom yum and currently I can say um, how's there man? How was it? Out of 10, what do you give? 8 out of 10. 8 out of 10. So we got this tom yum moussa for like I think 60 baht which is really good. Looks really good here. So yeah, can't wait to dig in. So for 60 baht it's pretty good. I'm not gonna lie. Really flavorful, good portion. Um, really nice. So you like the crispy wonton, I think it's minced chicken and pork, some chili sauce soup, chili soup, some leg noodles and egg too. So Harry's enjoying So he's the one who actually found this place. So thank you man. Pretty empty. 